Today, I find myself in a big empty. I can look around, it's just an empty room. I can even hear a bit of an echo. Happy Saturday. But this empty room makes me think that sometimes we all, just as people, feel empty inside, don't we? You might know someone right now that has expressed a sadness or a concern because they just feel empty. The problem comes most often from what we try to use to fill up that empty place inside, doesn't it? We know the world has a lot of options, a lot of things that it offers to fill that empty space. It, it may be chemicals, it may be sexual addiction, it may be busyness of work life. In the end, whatever it is, it still leaves us feeling empty inside. God's word from the beginning deals with the human condition, beginning to end. So I hope you're not surprised when you find out that there are scriptures that speak to our feelings of emptiness and loneliness and sorrow. The Psalms are full of poetry. Do not abandon me, Lord, for you are my all in all. God, you are my refuge and strength when I am lonely. God, I feel crushed, but you are my strength. In the New Testament, Paul wrote to the Roman church, may the God of hope fill you with all joy and peace as you trust him, so that you may overflow with hope by the power of the Holy Spirit. There you go. That's what we need. Overflow, not empty. Filled with good, not junk, not trivia. Filled with God's stuff, not the stuff of this world. Overflowing with hope in a brighter tomorrow and an ultimate eternal victory. Filled with hope, not empty. Filled up with Jesus. Let that make this a happy Saturday.